So today we got a brand new release of One Load 64. So if you're not sure what One Load 64 is, I covered this recently, well, a couple of months ago, which was in version 4 at the time. So uh, One Load 64 is pretty much a project a Commodore 64 fan is putting together. And it pretty much compresses multi disc games and cassette images into .CRT. So they're very quick at loading rather than waiting around for hours. Uh, so you can take a look at the information over on the Lemon64 website and the creator of this is asking you to actually subscribe to his channel in order to get the link. Uh, there's no link at the moment and I was just recently speaking to the person behind this project and uh, yeah, as soon as you subscribe to his channel, you'll be able to get a link so you can download version 5. But anyway, the so link for this one is going to be in my description. So let's take a look what version 5 has got to offer then. So if you're new to Commodore 64 emulation, take a look through my micro emulation playlist. I've covered and done setup guides for probably around 10 Commodore 64 emulators at this point. But I totally recommend Vice Vice's well kind of my favorite so i've got the shortcut for vice times 64 just here and in one load 64 which i've just downloaded uh, this is what you're going to get so you've got a few folders here uh, alternative formats we got bin files here uh, we also got easy flash files so if you're using a device on a real physical commodore 64 uh, most of these files will likely work on it, uh, such as the Turbo Chameleon cartridge. Uh, we also got some crunch and uncrunch files just there. Uh, got tape cart files here. And if we come back out, we got dumps too. So there's lots here to be taken a look at. But the main part of this is going to be starting with the game One Invader. So games like Fifth Gear was released on cassette tape to my knowledge and they didn't see cartridge releases and obviously cartridges are the quickest route in loading c64 games so from version 4 to 5 there's a lot more games in here which the creator of this project has converted into dot crt and there's loads so what i'm going to do is just quickly choose a game and I'm going to boot it up with my emulator so I'm going to go for a tip called cassette release uh blink is scary school I don't think that was actually released on cartridge but it's converted into .crt which is obviously cartridge uh, format so if I just drag that onto my vice shortcut instantly loaded like I said so what I'm going to do is just have a little play with this And as you can see there, that has a very quick loader. So let's check out something else, something I'm a bit more familiar with. So as we can see, there are a lot of games here in uh, version five of One Load 64, really awesome stuff. Okay, so we got DJ Possible Capers just there. This was definitely a cassette release. I had this one on cassette uh, back in the early 90s when I was a kid. So let's just see how quickly this one loads up. Thank you. 
thought that game is very hard. <laughs> so what else have we got here? Okay, so Exelon, again, this was a cassette release, so let's just check this one out. As we can see that one's working really fine too very quick loaders and uh really useful if you just can't be bothered to wait around a few minutes for a game to load so i'm going to just scroll through these so you can get a good idea of what's actually here and what you're going to be downloading but like i say if you do want to download this uh just subscribe to the creator's channel and you will then get the link to download this And if you're not a member of Lemon64, I seriously urge you to join it. It's the best way to keep up to date with C64 uh, releases like this one I'm doing today. Okay, so we've got Jack the Nipper 2 again. I'm pretty sure this was uh, released by Kix, and I do remember this one being on cassette, so let's try this one out. I'm not playing too well today. I've got a bit of a bad head from last night, but never mind. But anyways, you get a good idea of what's included in version 5 of One Load 64. Uh, so yeah, like I've been saying, just subscribe to the creator's channel. And um, you can play these games yourself on the emulator. Or like I say, use it on real hardware if you've got something like an SD device. But anyways, like I say, if you like the video today, hit notifications, subscribe and like so you don't miss upcoming retro emulation content. Also join me on social media, Facebook, Instagram, Twitter and TikTok. And just like I said at the start, just take a look through my micro emulation playlist if you're looking at setting up a Commodore 64 emulator on Windows PC. I've got everything there from Vice to Denise and lots of different front ends as well for C64 emulation. Lots going on on my channel with Commodore. We love Commodore, apart from the one person who seems to dislike every C64 video I upload. But never mind, never mind. Anyways, until next time, stay retro.